one week until my first show with Dublin. Ooh, Lord. Um, so I'm gonna write her story now. It's Friday. Um, and next week we are leaving on Thursday to go to her. Hey, Sat. Um, so yeah, yesterday I gave Dublin a bath and I took this one with me. This is my new puppy. Oof. This is Oakley, he's a black lab. We got him on Wednesday. Um, but me, Aubrey, and Cassie are going cross country schooling with Spark of Dublin and Splash. And then Janessa's gonna be giving us a lesson. So it should be super fun. Can you not chew on that, please? He's in a stage of chewing on everything. Everything. Stop it. Even though you have so many toys. He does not like his crate because I have to leave him in his crate when I go to school. I'm gone for like three hours in the morning, so he's in his crate for that. And then I come home for lunch, and then he's in his crate for another, depending on the day, another 45 minutes or another three hours. But he's not a fan of it. He will scream and cry. Isn't that why you poor thing? Stop it. So. Yeah, we're going cross country school tomorrow, and I think I have a lesson on Monday. And then we just pack. <laughs> then we're leaving on Thursday, Thursday afternoon. We're gonna get there and do a lesson, and then we start showing. Our ride times come out on Tuesday, and then our stabling comes out Wednesday, so. We're gonna figure it out. Now settle with your leg on. Yeah, jump everything like that. Whatever, we'll start walking now. Go ponies. Oh, we get double on taking it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Lovely. We'll focus in on Gracie. For the vlog. Lovely Gracie. So I'm leaving the barn right now. And we just went cross country schooling. So yeah, that was fun. Um Dublin was super good. And I already put in videos, so you guys already saw how we did. Oh so I feel like more prepared for the show now after that. Thankfully. So now we just keep going and we hope I'm ready for the show. I think all I need to work on now is my dressage test. Um, so we'll see how that goes. I think I'm riding on Monday and then I'll, that's it. So that's last time before the show. Scary. Scary stuff. I'll see you guys when I get back because it's prom night. So I'll show you guys getting me ready. Hey, um, student services scheduling help A plus session. So go to that because they can help you figure out. A
Okay. Jesus. I had a game yesterday. My lips are really swollen. What the fuck? They're like puffy. So I need to finish packing my stuff. I need to go finish packing Dublin stuff. I'm picking up Aubrey from school and then we're leaving. I keep forgetting to vlog. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's raining in my area right now. Um, but I have all my shavings back there. It is literally blocking my view from behind, but it's okay. We'll be to the barn soon. Um, so yeah, I got shavings. My tack box is back there. Every everything's back there. I got food. It's terrible. I have like no room in my car. Uh, uh, now I just hope I have everything because we're going to go grab Dublin stuff. And we hope I remember to grab everything for Dublin. So yeah. It's gonna be interesting. <sighs> yeah, I don't know if I got everything for myself, but I manage. If I need to, I can just make a quick run to Target or something. I don't know. Because I'm bringing my car up, so. This is where I'll be sleeping. This is my new home for the for the weekend. It's lovely. <laughs> I'm so stressed right now. Um, I'm now realizing I think I left my glasses at Target. Mm, it's lovely. Oh, that's upsetting. It's my fifth pair of the same glasses, and they're from Target. Hopefully they're in the back somewhere, just like crushed by stuff. Um, if they're not, it's gonna be really sad. I'm gonna cry a little bit about that. So, uh, whatever, we'll see how this goes. I'm not confident in myself. I needed Christina to do this for me. I needed her to make me a list. Um, so I could check everything off and it just, uh, I don't trust myself enough. But yeah, we're going to the barn. We're gonna see, go talk to Bailey and we're gonna, me and Bailey are gonna pack stuff up. We're gonna go pick up Aubrey and then we're gonna load the ponies up. And I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. Wish me luck. Okay, once there's more people, I'll be able to film more because then people will be able to film me and I won't have to film everything. But I just finished packing up most of Dublin's stuff. I just need like a saddle and stuff. And I got most things out of my car. Um, so yeah, now I'm just going to pick up Aubrey. And uh, sh then we're gonna load up the ponies and be on our way. I think Cassie and Janessa are like already there, almost there. I'm not sure what time they left, actually. Um, but we'll see. Yeah. Got the boy. Got the boy. We're stuck in traffic right now. Yay. Woo! Ah. We're trying to get to the show. And we're stuck in traffic because there's a car crash ahead of us. And then there's construction, of course. So that's fun. I don't even know where my horse is right now. They're they're gone. They're lost. They're, lost. We don't know where they are. We, they're taking a back road, and apparently they're getting their cross to the house. We thought we were gonna get there before her. Um, that just didn't happen. So we'll see how life goes. <laughs> so my windshield wipers just broke. We're on the side of the road and for the rain to stop. It literally looks sunny, so it doesn't look Real. It like doesn't look like it's raining when it's raining and it, we can't drive with because I can't see. It's like sunny right in front of us, but I can't get to the sun. We're like 20 minutes away from the horse show. Our horse is already there. And we're having people unload them for us. It's wonderful. <laughs> okay, do you think we can go now? You think we can?
my god, there's a whole spot in there too. I thought it was just a whole hey, living. Look, it's my sundowner. <laughs> Off, eat it. Fancy horse. Sprinkle. Hi, Dubs. Boy, drinking water. Boy. Boy, good evening. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're We're all the way at the end. Hi. Hi. Good. They're good. We're getting him hay. Getting dubs hay. What? Hay. Um, I didn't check. This sparkles in hay. I don't know. I don't want to feed her. Yeah, we just because I don't. I don't know what Jennifer wants to do with her. Mm. She prefers hold over here. Cause she's she wants to be the end boy. specific with. Oh my god! This would make that's our trailer right there. Okay. Oh my god! I'm getting service here. I'm getting all my notifications now. Oh my um. Hey, which one's mine? Hey. It's really hot outside if you're not keeping this. And it realizes it's going. You just think of our conversation about parts and pants. And it realizes it's going. She's struggling. Damn. She's struggling. I have 20 braids to do. Right Dublin. <laughs> We're not even going to judge the braiding either. Pony on crack. Dan alive. Oh, girl. Teenage girl. girl. <laughs> Teenage girl. <laughs> Struggling. Yes. Look at those hands. Can you do it? Sit back. Take your knee off your saddle, Christina. More weight on your right stirrup. Yes. There's no 
I'm getting down on it. I'm not gonna get over there to be yeah, it's fine. I didn't think they would be in different arenas. If we hadn't talked during this video, she would have gotten some very nice background music for her vlog. That was good. It was beautiful. I this canna, though. This canna felt really nice. So do I. It's okay. It's acceptance. <laughs> we finished dressage and we have stadium in. When stadium? I don't know. I don't know when stadium. <laughs> Great. Should we ask one of the campers if we can take a shower at their camper? <laughs> Let's walk down this aisle. Whoa, look at those. I want one of these stalls. There's a YouTuber. There's a YouTuber? Who? I don't know if that's in here. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, that's the other one. Shit. Oh, good job. Okay. Let's see. We're like we're I've jumped like this height on him in cross country, but it just feels so massive. Oh my god, this looks massive too. 
I'm such a pussy. Jesus Christ. You are on a ponytail. Little baby. Yeah. Well, and especially after the round I just had. <laughs> At least I know I won't fall off. How funny. It's hard to have fun when your pony wants to get you off. Okay, wait, no, no, no. This is really cute. I like this. Kind of puts them. Like, I think here's the thing. If I can jump it on foot, then I think I can jump it on dumb foot. No, it's not. What? One more. Oh, that's a. Oh, I don't like that turn. Take a nice spot on the hill while you're walking it. <sighs> Someone's gonna look. jump this. I'll tell you, nine out of ten people quit riding the last cross country jump. Go from nine out of ten. Here we come down. Right? Yeah. Anywhere you want on that Are we allowed oh. to like that? Walk that? I can Yes, you can. I can or not. I feel like Dublin's just gonna. No, this one's cute. I like this one. I think this is my favorite jump. It's small. Um, so after cross country or after walking cross country, I just didn't film anything else. I'm so bad at that. Um, but like, just to brief over what happened over that weekend, um, I think it went really well. I think we learned a lot in dressage. I was super nervous and I, cause it was like my first horse trial, first part of it. I was super tense during it. So I did not get the score that I wanted to get, but I think overall it went pretty okay for being my first horse trial and Dublin's first horse trial. And then the stadium was interesting. We knocked one rail as you guys saw, which was my fault. I should have just, pushed him. I kind of tried to hold him to get to a deep spot and his back legs just hit it. And then um, he was already, during warm up, he already was not a fan of the boots. And if you guys are hearing stuff, it's Lisa Wallace in the back. <laughs> um, he was already not a fan of the back boots I had on him because I normally don't ride him in back boots, but I put them on and um, yeah, he was not a fan of them during warm ups. So I think that just added to it. And then I was also super tense, so it just didn't mix well. So then he got a little frantic about everything. And then he threw a fit after a couple of events, as you guys saw. And it just was not the stadium round I would have liked to have, but I'm proud of him for sticking with me. And then cross country went absolutely amazing. It went clear, um, no refusals. Um, we did have, a time fault for going one second too fast because right before that I saw so many riders fall so I was just so nervous so I made the decision not to start my timer or my clock on my watch because I didn't want to worry about going too slow so I was like I'm not gonna worry about my time I just want to you know get through it and um, I did up going too fast <laughs> which you know is okay I'm happy with that we ended up getting eighth place so we got a ribbon, we ended up placing, and I'm just ultimately so proud of how he did. And I'm so thankful for him because he really helped me through this whole weekend. <laughs>